Hello my friends, in this lecture we will be going over 1999 Amy problem number 11. Here is a view of this problem. We are given this expression here, this summation on the left hand side of this expression and we would like to compute its value and we claim it will be equal to tangent m over n where m and n are relatively prime numbers such that m over n is less than 90 degrees and ultimately the question is asking for m plus n so let's just stick to the left hand side and see if we can expand it somehow but then we have solved so many examples about um, telescoping so remember our sine 1 trick so in this particular case though instead of multiplying the left hand side by sine 1 I propose that we multiply it and divide it by sine 5 and let's see what we get so we start with the left hand side and as I said, I would multiply and divide both sides by sine of 5 degrees. So that whole thing would become as follows. So it would become sine uh, 5 times sine 5k. Now at this step, I can go ahead and apply the uh, product to some formulas. So and hopefully um, I would get 1 over sine of 5 summation again k equals from 1 to 35 um, so um, if you remember the uh, product to some formulas for sine times sine it would be cosine the difference minus cosine the sum over 2 so we would get the whole thing over 2 cosine the difference first in this case 5 minus 5k or 5k minus 5 wouldn't matter because cosine and uh, the properties of the cosine function so 5k minus 5 minus, and this time it will be the sum, so 5k plus 5. And, and that's really a nice, very, very nice result, because now our, um, our terms inside the summation sign is in telescoping uh, format. I can go ahead and um, see what's going on here. Uh, in fact, I can even take uh, out the 2, so I would have 2 sine 1 over 2 sine 5 and I'm opening my brackets when I plug in k equals 1 I would get cosine 0 um, minus um, cosine 5 and then when I plug in 2 I would get cosine 5 um, minus cosine of 15 um, right uh, oh sorry I should have gotten a 10 here sorry for that um, so this one would be a 15 and let's try one more uh, before that let me just go ahead and erase this thing here I don't need any of this so there's a 2 here so when I plug in k equals 3 I would get 15 minus 5 so cosine of 10 minus cosine of 20 right and so on and finally if I plug in uh, 34 I would get cosine of 5 times 34 which is 170 minus 5 165 um, minus cosine of um, 5 times uh, 34 again 170 so 175 and finally when I plug in 35 I would get cosine of um, 175 um, uh, so 170 actually 170 minus cosine of 180 80 degrees 180 degrees now um, and I can close the big brackets here this one actually so I would get simply 1 over 2 times sine of 5 and when you look at the expression this long expression we see quite a few terms would actually simply cancel out for example this minus cosine 10 would cancel with that cosine 10 and in a similar way this cosine 15 will cancel with the next term here and so on when we check the very last terms we would just realize that the remaining terms uh, would simply be a cosine of this term here and actually this term so this whole thing uh, would become cosine 0 plus cosine 5 minus cosine of 175 minus cosine of 180 so therefore from here we would get 1 over 2 times sine of 5 and when you look inside you realize cosine 0 here minus cosine 180 here so that's a plus 1 this is minus minus 1 which is another plus 1 
So I would have a 2 plus, and then a cosine 5, which is equal to minus cosine of 175. So it would be, I should rather say, um, minus, huh? minus 2 times cosine of 175. But then I can immediately observe that the 2s here will cancel, and I would be left with this very nice expression, 1 minus cosine of 175 divided by sine of 5. But then as a final step, I will just replace that sine of 5 with, um, with sine of 175 for a good reason, because I remember that this is just the half angle formula for the tangent. So that whole thing is just equal to tangent 175 degrees over 2 and as a result the desired answer would be just um, and obviously 175 over 2 is definitely less than 90 so the answer would be 175 plus 2 which is simply equal to 177 and I'm done.